I want to be a bit different than everybody else. <laughs> there you go. There's my outfit for tomorrow. I just put the glue on the side like that. Also, tip afterwards, take lash curlers. Really good idea, but you've got to make sure that your lash glue... Right, so this is what it looks like. That is on my vanity. Like, just look how cute it is. They were like, okay then, bet you, you definitely won't walk in in pyjamas tomorrow. Teachers are gonna love it, and I'm gonna love it too. That is a lot, and it's the Dior one. Of Sometimes I think, what are you wearing? What if I ask them to like do it at the salon when I'm doing work experience? Hey guys, it's Rosie and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video is another school related video and that is me getting ready for my non-school uniform day. In England, as most of you know, we do have to wear school uniform to school, but a couple of times a year we actually get a non-school uniform day, which means we can wear our own clothes with a couple of rules, obviously, and that is what I have tomorrow, so I want to be a bit different than everybody else. <laughs> So guys, before we get on with this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos just like this one and stay tuned all the way to the end because I'm thinking of wearing something so different to all of my friends that I will probably get weird looks at school. So stay tuned. And I'm going to meet Lily on the bus, so I'm even getting on a public bus wearing this outfit as well. Let's get on with the video. Okay, so firstly, I do need to pick my outfit. And I'm kind of grateful that we actually have uniforms at school because then we don't have to like the hassle of trying to pick out an outfit every day, um, which, to be honest, I think would be quite annoying. Um, so I do like non-school uniform day. But I'm thinking of wearing a onesie to school because I just want to be comfortable, to be honest. And nobody ever wears onesies. It's all like, you have to dress nicely, you have to dress nicely. Um, so, I'm gonna wear a unicorn onesie with slippers. But then, it's meant to be like, I don't know, 23 degrees, um, because it's Friday. And if I wear this onesie, which is absolutely super fluffy, I'm gonna be really hot. So I might wear cycling shorts with a crop top underneath so that if it gets really hot, I can take it off and have that as well. Okay, right, I'm in my casual drawer at the moment. Let me just unravel this. So I'm getting these shorts out because I'm gonna wear some cycling shorts underneath. Just some normal black ones. My room is really tidy at the moment, by the way. I'm really proud of myself. And I have a white fox top. Also, we literally just cleared out my cupboard. Um, I don't know what one it is. Ah, oh, here it is, right. And then this white fox top, because like, it's pretty cute. And then underneath that, would just be that and that. You know what I mean, underneath it. Coolio's. But now I need to pick my shoes. And I'm actually debating whether to wear my pink Jordans with that, whether to wear my slippers with it, because I feel like that will just make the look. I think I'm just gonna wear my slippers, because like they go a lot. And then I feel like it would look quite cute to wear like my slippers and that, you know, because then I'm still making the statement. This is what it looks like. And then I'm gonna put my shorts here, and then my top here, like that. And then I'm gonna put my shoes here, like that. And then, there you go. There's my outfit for tomorrow. Right, so I actually started this video and then realized one of my lashes are actually missing. I don't know if you can see it or not, but the one here is missing. So I need to do this again. By the way, I've done these lashes myself. These are the, um, just the individuals from Primark, by the way. Just these ones. Love them. I don't like to use the Primark glue. I just put the glue on the side like that. I obviously don't need that much because I'm only using one. So I use these tweezers. And what I do is I just lift this up a bit so that I can get underneath. And then I'm just using one of these small ones because it goes big, medium and small. I get the lash, put some glue on the lash. And then I just put the lash under there and stick that down and then that's all good. 
and I squeeze the lash onto my natural lashes. You know what I mean? There we go, right. So there's my lashes done. Mum's here because I asked her to take a thumbnail with me with my lashes. I'm with the camera, here with my... Because Primark have brought back their new lashes and I'm absolutely just so... I bought three packs of them because they're just so amazing. I've done one, two lashes, full volume, looks like natural extensions, and I've only used like one packet, still got enough for like a full eye, and this, and this. Also, tip afterwards, once your lashes are mostly dry, take lash curlers, really good idea, but you've got to make sure that your lash glue has been on there for at least 10 minutes, and you go onto your lashes and you, I'm just using this side because that side's dry, and you just do that, and it just sticks your natural lashes to your fake ones, and they just look really good, so yeah, you can also do that with strip lashes. Right, so I am going to do a TikTok now, and um, my TikTok has got banned, well, it's been banned, but we've got it back up now, so I need to make sure, like, literally all my skin's covered, but I'm doing it in this, but I've got to make sure that this is up, this is down, that I've got no of this area out, and I'm gonna do a TikTok now, so. It didn't look like much, but I've got to put a caption on it. And it's basically, I've seen these people do it, look, where they do this, look. They do like 10 missed calls from dad, and it's like two missed calls from my mum. Just gonna edit it. I can show you me editing it, doing my editing skills. Right, this is what it looks like. Normally, so I'm gonna put missed calls. This is what it looks like. Right, guys, I need to get to bed because I need to get ready in the morning as well. We make I wake up quite early because I need to get on the bus. So, yeah, see you in the morning. Morning guys, it's non-school uniform day and I'm just like so excited, so I need to, I actually don't need to do much, I just need to do a bit of makeup and then brush my hair really and then put my clothes on, get on the bus, go to school and probably get laughed at by loads of people but we love it. Right, <laughs> time to get ready. Right, let's do a bit of makeup. I'm gonna show you my quick makeup routine. Lights on. Also, can you come here? Look at this photo of me and Lily. Wait, let me turn this down so that you can see it. That is on my vanity. Like, just look how cute it is. Right, it's really hot today, so I'm starting out with some sun cream. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just rubbing that in. This also makes my skin look so dewy. It. Some people are like, no, it makes my face look so greasy and I don't like it. But to be honest, I really like that look. It makes me look like I'm on holiday and then it just gives me that holiday smell, you know what I mean? Right, so I was talking with my friends last night, right? And they were like, I was like, as a joke, I'm gonna wear pajamas. By the way, I'm using foundation as my concealer so that it doesn't look like I've got makeup on. I was like, I'm gonna put pajamas on as a joke. And they were like, oh no, you wouldn't do that. That's so silly. We'll just wear like normal stuff. And I'm like, yes, I would do that. They were like, okay then, I bet you, you definitely won't walk in in pajamas tomorrow. And I was like, okay, I'm going to wear a onesie to school, which is gonna look absolutely amazing. Teachers are gonna love it. And I'm gonna love it too. And then also, I'm taking my metal straws in. So as you, as some of you will know, when I was a bit younger, I had my own merch, like my own merchandise. I'm definitely going to make some new merch in the future though. Um, but I did actually have metal straws and I've got a whole box of them in my room out there. Um, and I was talking to my biology teacher about it the other day because she was like, all of this stuff, say, like biodiversity, saving the planet and stuff. I was like, oh, miss, I, may, I used to have metal straws. 
and she was like, oh my gosh, Rosie, if you've got any left, then bring some in. And as a joke to the class, I say a lot of jokes. I was like, who wants a free metal straw? Literally, all hands got up, and everyone's like, I want one, I want one. So then I'm going to bring them in today, and yeah, they're all gonna like attach them to their bags, they said, and I was like, oh, amazing, great. And everyone was like, I'm gonna use these for my slushies, because at my school, they sell slush puppies, or in America, you call them Slurpees. Right, by the way, this is my new favorite product. This is by Florence by Mills. I use quite a lot of Florence, but it's like this brow wax stick, and you basically just put this wax on your brow, and then it's got like this little brush here. The bristles are lovely and soft, and you just brush this up like so just how you'd normally do your lashes. And then I literally just go like this and now my brows look really nice. This is how I do it. So you literally just put the wax on your brow and you use this little brush to just brush them over. This is how I do my brows. Everybody does theirs differently. I've got quite thick brows naturally, which I'm really lucky to have. That is a lot and it's the Dior one as well. Here and here. And then like a tad on my nose, like that. This is just like a really quick and easy just look to do in the summer. Um, especially I don't want to do a full face, one for school and two because I've got lashes on. So I either have a full face, no lashes, or light makeup with lashes. I breathe in and I put the like excess on my collarbone. Right, I need to get dressed. I'm so excited to get this on. But I can already feel in my room it is absolutely boiling. So I'm going to be absolutely sweltering today. Uh, is that even a word? I think it is. Anyways, luckily I'm going to have this on underneath. So, yeah. Right, I have this outfit on and then I think it would look cool with the slippers. You know what I mean? I'm going to have Nike socks on or just any socks on. And then this with the slippers would just make a statement. Anyways, and now I'm going to put this onesie on. like this and then I might just have it like that boom I'm also gonna it looks better with the head up outfit for the day I've just got okay right these are my straws I'm just putting them in this little bag here so that when I get to school I can just give them out and they're just easy this is cute bag I forgot I had this I'm hot already, so I'm just gonna take it down halfway. But this is my straw. And then it just goes like that. Pretty cool. This is my packaging, it's really cute. I tried to make it look as much as it, like an AirPod case as I could. This is the cleaner, and what you do is you put it through the straw and then pull it out. Um, and then this is the clip, you attach that onto there and you can clip it onto you. So I could like clip it onto my thing here like that. I need to pack my school bag. Right, so I have drama, so I just use this notepad. And then this actually has brown paper, which I thought was really cool. I just do all my work in here. Maths, science, I've got the same letters as I had yesterday. And then I've just got my pencil case. I normally keep stuff in my blazer. Um, so I need a pencil case today. I don't normally bring a pencil case. A brush for my hair. Perfect. Favorite brush, by the way. Let me repack that stuff in. I've got to get out of this house, guys, because I'm absolutely boiling and I've got to get on the bus. It is so hot today and I'm in this. Absolutely boiling. <sighs> it was absolutely boiling. It was such a fun day today, guys. Like, literally, it went into assembly like this, and everybody saw me in my onesie. I did take it off when I was doing drama because we were doing, like, acting, and I got really, really hot. But when we were sitting outside, it was quite windy, and everybody thought it was gonna be really hot, so they had shorts on. And I was just there, all cozy and warm in my um, onesie, but then once I got inside, it was really hot. 
Um, everybody wanted a straw, so there's nothing left in that. And yeah, I had a pretty decent day. I got a lot of weird stares, especially from teachers um, and some other girls because I go to an all girls school and there's some girls that don't think that we should dress like this, we should dress all pretty and nice. Um, so they stared at me and I just smiled at them and walked away because you know what, I'm comfortable and sometimes I think what are you wearing? Anyways, most of my friends I caught, well actually all of my friends had really nice outfits on. They had like nice cargoes with Jordans, little tops. Lily looks really nice today. She had um, this black top on, but everyone had nice shoes on, really nice outfits. I come stumbling in, waddling in, in this. Um, yeah, it was great, but I had so much fun. Also, everyone, I was saying like, I'll give free hugs out because everyone was calling me like a teddy bear today. So that was really funny. Um, and everyone just gave me a hug. Yeah, but anyway, overall, I had such a fun day. It was, it was really fun. My form tutor said to me, um, Rosie, what are you wearing? You can't wear that. And I went, where did it say in the non-school uniform book that I'm not allowed to wear a onesie? And she went, Fair play, he's fine. And I was like, yeah, miss, that's what I thought. She loves me and I love her. Um, I did give some of my teachers the straws. So guys, that is the end of this video, but I do actually have work experience next week and I'm going to work in a real life salon, the one where I got my balayage done on my 13th birthday and got my hair chopped. I'm going to that salon, I'm working in there for a week um, and it's just gonna be so much fun because I do know them, I'm going to film it because the salon are actually happy for me to film it. So I'm going to take you on my whole entire journey through the week of me going to work experience. I need to buy clothes, I need to do all of this stuff, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, so stay tuned and subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss that because that will be a funny week. Um, anyways, yeah. So I really hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, as I said, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos just like this one. I love you all guys and I will see you next time. Bye. Also, remember to like the video if you want me to get my hair dyed. What if I ask them to like do it at the salon when I'm doing work experience? Do you think I could? Like, once that work's all over, or like if they've got a free slot. Anyway, guys, bye. Might be getting my hair done next week. Oh, and by the way, check out some of my other videos here. And like I said, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget my new song, Safe In Your Love, is out now everywhere. Click the bottom left square to listen to it.